Welcome back. So in the previous tutorial we downloaded an animated character from Mixamo. So I have the download here and now we're going to bring it into C4. If you uh, extract your zip file and I put it into a subdirectory of my C4 installation under the import folder under tutorial I'm going to create a folder and call it model. models. And then I'm going to put my um, Collada file in there. Okay, let's go straight to C4. And so we have this directory now which shows us the Collada file and some textures. Now the textures which aren't in TGA, TGA format need to be converted, so I'll open this one here for JPEG. I'm opening it with, um, I use a program called paint.net, it's very lightweight, very simple, it's free, and it lets you convert, for example, JPEG files into TGA files, because that's the format that uh, C4 would be looking for when you want to import textures. So I'm saving this uh, texture of our character simply as TGA, save it, have it there already, um, so I'm going to say no actually on that one, cancel, um, let me see what happened here, so I took the i.jpg, open it up with print.net, ok, save as, and we're going to save it as TGA, i, yeah, cool, I'm going to call it i.tga. There is already a TGA in there. OK, save. And I'm going to take the defaults, OK. And we're done with paint.net. We've got two TGA textures now. So we're going to start T4 and import those TGA textures. Press escape. Um, and then press the tilde key, which is just below the escape button. On most machines, I'm going to click um, import texture and it shows you that under import tutorials model textures we have the two tga files we just looked at open and import using the standard default settings and then i'm going to import the other texture import texture again and import using the defaults and here you can see that the import was successful in both cases so now we're going to import the actual collada file we go to new world which is just control n and then we say world import scene, and I pick the uh, Collada file, import, I'm going to unclick everything here, leave the scale factor as it is, and press OK. So here's the model, and these, uh, this funny looking texture material on the model just indicates that um, it can't find the texture, so I double click on the material here, and I select everything which looks like it can't find the texture, and the reason is because it's in a subdirectory of the directory where the um, model itself is. So I it's in this texture subdirectory here. So I select I of text, okay, and here I select new Vincent texture one k two dot text, and here I do the same thing, okay. And I press close and it takes the texture down. So I'm right clicking here and using the WASD keyboard uh, keys to move around the model. I can also here click up on the, uh, on the camera tool here, which allows me to more easily uh, pan and uh, move around the character. Anyway, so world. Save to model resources, and I'm going to call this boxer. I have a, a previous example here. I'm going to override that with the new one. Save, override existing file, yes. So now we've got the model. Close, don't save. We just use that world to import the Collada file. And now we can say open model. I'm going to open the boxer.mdl file. There we go. Nothing good. Um, and now what I do is I import and I select the Collada file, press the import button, and here we go. We've got this uh, animation, and I'm going to click loop, and it should play. There we go. 
So now you've successfully imported a collaborative file into C4 into your Leeds animation.